Well, breaking now at five, Plymouth police have identified the person behind a string of incidents of vandalism around town. And police believe that it's a 17 year old who's responsible for spraying some landmarks, including Plymouth Rock. WBZ's Bill Shields is live in Plymouth tonight with the latest. Bill? David and Paula, that 17 year old is not really known to police before now. He's a student at Plymouth South High School, but he's now facing nearly a dozen felony charges. On the morning of February 17th, people in Plymouth woke up to find numerous historical sites had been spray painted with red paint. Not only was the iconic Plymouth rock painted, but in Brewster Gardens, the Pilgrim Maiden statue was sprayed. And several large decorative shells were hit, even the Forefathers Monument. Police now say video surveillance was key in identifying the person who did this. A lot of it was video related. Uh, the evidence that we were, secure, we were able to secure through surveillance tapes uh, pointed us in the right direction and ultimately was uh, assisted us in solving the case. No real explanation as to the reason why. Uh, simply a young juvenile making a poor judgment call and uh, that's all he really had to say. He didn't really identify that to us. Now, several days after all that spray painting, the 9-11 memorial was vandalized in Plymouth, in uh, the north part of Plymouth. But police at this point do not believe this 17-year-old teenager was responsible for that. Reporting live from Plymouth, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.